division bout. Every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the floor. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponent. You make one mistake, night's over. He cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai fighter, holding a professional record of 12 wins, one loss. He stands five feet, eight inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Rafael Alamabillion! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Oh, big left hand there. Head kick, that's a miss. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Straight right, he misses. Well, you're starting to see the damage now bleeding from his cheek. Huge block there. Well, perhaps 
a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Big ball points land. Now he gets back to the ring. Oh! Oh, big left. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Three minutes to go. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Lee gets touched by that kick there. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Nice punch there by Lee. Oh, straight right. Beautiful leg kick thrown. And both guys really throwing with authority. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. His opponent still stands. I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gotta be over very soon. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, do you believe that another head kick lands? Gotta start raising that guard or this is gonna be the end of the fight. You gotta start raising the guard and guiding that head kick down back towards your feet. You cannot take it clean and you cannot take it from one on. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. Campbell inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. That's a big strike right there. Oh, he continues to attack that bloody cheek. His face is a mess. Punch coming, it's blocked. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. Beautiful kick. Oh, nice knee to the body for him there. Very nice. Lee gets stung by that leg kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Oh, nice, nice right hand. Back and forth we go. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Oh, man, I think you jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did, because I have times where I've been kicked like that, and I'm gonna tell you one thing, it does not feel good. Well, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1 level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about Ready? his powerful kicks, Ready? how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Good punch, Lance. Lee gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Big kick, Lance. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Ooh, head kick, Lance. He's hurt. 
Lee's kick attempt, that one was blocked. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Out of range with that one. Oh man, head kick lands. Whiffs on that offering. Oh man, his leg kicks are outstanding and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Well, no surprises, he connects once again and that looked like it landed right on that cut. Right on the cut and he's targeting it, right? He's looking, you can see him almost putting a laser beat on that cut and just putting his hands on it. It doesn't take much, he's just keep making it split, showing his opponent that he has no mercy. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Big leg kick lands. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Just missed with the leg kick. Great punch. Well, he's always on the counter attack, but a nice leg kick there by Lee. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Nice leg kick land. Very tricky to throw that body kick. Checks that leg kick. Just out of range with that right hook. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Nice punch there. There's no tell on that leg kick. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockoff. Man, that cut has really opened up. Slips that left hand. Nice. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up. When it comes to his aggressiveness, certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Leg they kick. continue to exchange. 10 seconds. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Lee. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. All right, let us get you some highlights from that previous round, DC, and how about just the, the sheer volume of head kicks for him? I don't know why this dude's energy bar isn't completely zapped. You can't throw that many head kicks over the course of a fight, but I guess if you're landing them, you might as well keep throwing As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range. He'll suddenly he'll change his stance. 
Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. That was a thudding leg kick. Connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Left punch is clean, followed by a right. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's going to give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Good jab. Big kick lands. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Punch over the top. There's no give on that leg kick. Punch to the body is blocked. Beautiful body kick. Just missed with the left there. Goes upstairs for an elbow. It's such a fast leg kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, single collar tie here. Lee's knee strike is blocked. Ooh, big shot land. Back and forth we go here. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Just missed with that right hand. Big body kick land. Nice strike. Got clip with the right hand. If you take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Able to check the high kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Combination lands for him. It was hard to see it miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. He's like in a zone. It's like the basketball who becomes twice its size. This guy today is looking at focus, man. And is the point. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Oh, bone on bone, shin slash foot right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator and not a fighter? You see why? Yeah, those are fun. I'm telling you, man, you get kicked in the head. A lot of times, it's the end of the night. Got a little experience with that. Yes, I do. A little bit. Horrible. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter. Take the judges out of it. Head kick. Oh, nice right hand, John. Body shot now, but it's turned back by Lee. Stand tight. Get the double leg. Double leg's there. Double leg. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Ten seconds to go. Ooh, what a punch. And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books.
Nice work. Your cardio is sick. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Can't take many of those, you better check. His leg is hurt here, you can see him limping a little bit. Oh! Huge kick to the head. of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent got him going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, nice job to slip off the center line there. His head movement has been a huge, huge factor defensively in this fight. You can never be a stationary target. So even if the feet aren't moving, you got to be ready to slip that head at a moment's notice. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Nice straight punch. Way to hide that leg kick. Right 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 Misses with that punch. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Blocks the shot. Nice strike. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Leg kick after leg kick after leg kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Unable to connect with the right hand there. What a punch. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Nice kick. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Connects with the right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Nice leg kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. And he landed the right hand there. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Back and forth we go! Lee gets hit with a kick. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Visibly limping here. Defense there, huge block for him. 60 seconds now to go in the fight. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Real quick leg kick. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Nice punch land over the top. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Big leg kick land. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Right hand upstairs. 15 seconds to go. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. 
Connects with a right. Lands the right hand. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, so the round mercifully comes to an end, and how about the cut on his lip? Really, really bad. If that thing gets any worse, they're gonna certainly have to stop this fight. The doctor looks like he's already gonna be called in here. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went headhunting, landed, nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. All right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. So even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. How about that chin? Nice defense there, huge block. Powerful leg kick lands. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Back to the jab now, no good. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Beautiful right hook counter. I might let you kick the inside of my leg after the show. No. See how that feels. You don't want that, J.A. You do not want that. No one wants that. Even trained professional fighters right. can't take too many of those strikes. Oh, big punch land. Nice head kick. Beautiful leg kick throw. Digging kick. Well, he is a tactician. He does not discriminate when it comes to his weapons. There's a side kick. That side kick can go to the legs or to the body. What a technique. Great punch landed with so much power. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Three minutes now to go to decide this one. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. One of the most important strikes of the clinch is this big body shot. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Oh, man. Kick there by Lee. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Nice head kick. And he switches his stance yet again. Oh, good kicks. Well, what a great showcase for these two fighters and this division, down to the wire between two of the best. They show what type of fighter this division possesses. They should be very proud, both of them. Lands flush with that right hand. Good stick. Well, not much set up behind it. The right hook misses. And that one certainly found the target. 90 seconds to go in the fight. It's big left hook coming. It's blocked. Big kick. Just misses there with the left. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. One minute to go in the fight. Oh, straight 
right. Beautiful body just lands right under the elbow. Left hand punch to the clinch. And they separate. Big kick lands. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Game of inches right there, yeah. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Big head kick land. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, and he always brings his hands right back to his face. Look at that turnover and that kick. All right, so the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking game. Yeah, he did a great job of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance, and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. Official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 48-47. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Well, he did not get the finish.